all right so how's it going everybody hope you all doing well hope you all doing great and today we are looking at the leaked benchmarks of the ryzen 5 7600 x and we are kind of like taking a look at the approach that amd are taking towards the market you know it feels like they are more focused towards making a cpus that are for gaming rather than anything else like they want to be very good at one thing and one thing only and that's gaming and what we're looking at right now is a ryzen 5 7600x or a Ryzen CPU that's a 6 cores and a 12 threaded CPU and there was a leaked benchmarks of this CPU compared to their highest end Ryzen 5950X which is a 32 threaded CPU so basically this is a CPU that's double the amount of threads and long story short it has been tested at a benchmark system or a benchmark application called powerboard 3.0 and when it comes to the performance or the results as you can see right now these them design for engineering sample or the ryzen 7600x it was on average 10 percent faster than the ryzen 9 5950x so the most recent rumors says that the ryzen 7000 series may appear somewhere in early august so maybe a month from now basically so basically looking at if this is a good thing or not i really cannot tell because it hasn't been like benchmarked against something like a ryzen 5800 x3d and at the same time the ryzen 5600x is slower than the 5950x on average gaming by like 10 to 20 percent so does this mean that the 7600x is faster by 30 percent we really are yet to see as you can see from the benchmarks actually is slower and this doesn't look like the multi-threaded performance uh, benchmark or a benchmark based on the cpu cores basically so it's more around the gaming um, capacity of the cpu that it can handle so really and this is still an engineering sample so that doesn't mean this is the highest capability of this cpu maybe you will see more performance and better by like 10 to 20 percent hopefully and uh, the intel 13th gen cpus are actually gonna be faster than the previous gen the 12th gen intel cpus by 15 percent when it comes to the ipc so expect to see similar performance gains in terms of gaming you know if not 10 percent only but the biggest difference is that these intel cpus they will have pretty much a bigger amount of course so maybe amd is the gaming cpu king while intel is basically into more video editing and things focused on that or maybe amd is just throwing their last punch at you know trying to produce something to the market and this is not a good cpu at all and intel cpus will perform the same if not better but this is an engineering sample and we're yet to see so that's been it i really don't know what to say about the amd cpus because there hasn't been a lot of things and that i don't want to make a quick or early judgment on it and hey if you like the video press on that like button if you want to see more videos that can subscribe see you in the next one and peace